Welcome back to the third tutorial in formatting text with CSS. In this tutorial we are going to take a look at the border property. What we want to do is, is put a border around a paragraph. So here we have three paragraphs and let's put a border around the middle one. So since that has the P2 text class, we're going to go over here and double click on that and inside our CSS style panel and let's click on border. And we have the options of style, width, and color. So we are going to leave the same for all checked because we're just going to put a box basically around the P2 text paragraph. You click on uh, top here and you have some options. You have solid, which we're going to use. And we can you can check the other ones out if you want, but I usually uh, just like to use solid. I'm going to make it small. It's not going to be it's not going to be very thick. It's just going to be one pixel. And let's make it uh let's make it black. And let's apply and you can see that we now have some text that is outlined in black. So let's take a look here. Yes. And there we go. You can also um so kind of weird. I'm not sure what's going on there. Huh. But uh, we can also do a few other things with the border. As you see, we have a box around the whole second paragraph. We can also just add a line, a border, to the left, right, top, or bottom. Uh, it's as easy as double clicking on the P3 text class in your CSS style panel and you click on border and you uncheck the same for all and that way you have a choice you have top right bottom and left uh, for this tutorial let's choose solid in the bottom row and uncheck that there and we'll say we'll set it to five pixels and make it black apply that and you can see that it applied a thicker border to the bottom of our P3 text class which is applied to this paragraph the third paragraph we are also going to add a border to the right and the left when it dotted so you can see what that looks like for this we'll give it a color black for the right, we'll give it a color black also. And let's make this the same. We'll make it five pixels. Go ahead and click apply. And now you can see that border on the left is dotted, and on the right it's solid. Let's see what it looks like when it's dashed. So you can see the different the difference here in the, the dotted and the dashed, and I, I personally think the solid looks best whenever you're outlining things. So you can see that. Um that is it for the border tutorial. In the next tutorial, we will be going over positioning. So stay tuned and subscribe. Thanks.